A new version of the Bible was unveiled today, a Jamaican version. The King James Bible has been translated into Jamaican Patois. The Bible Society of the West Indies believes it will make the Bible more relevant to the people around the world who speak Jamaican Patois. This is the latest translation of the New Testament. It's the Jamaican New Testament. Our Father, which art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. We Father, we in heaven. Make people have enough respect for you and your name. On each page, the King James Version and opposite, the Jamaican Patois. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our debts as we forgive our debtors. Today, give us the food where we need. Pardon we for all the wrong where we do. See them like how we pardon them where do we wrong. It's been a 20-year project by Reverend Courtney Stewart of the Bible Society of the West Indies to have it translated. He's in Birmingham this weekend, speaking to the city's large West Indian population. It's critical that we translate the Bible into our native language, Jamaican Patois, Jamaican Creole, because the scriptures make their greatest impact on people when they have it in their mother tongue. Sometimes what I have to do is look at the English and then then look at the, the, the written pattern and then I go, oh, that's how you pronounce it. It's not the easiest thing in the world to read, and there's a good reason for that. You see, it's an oral language and has been. So for the vast majority of us, it would be quite difficult for us to read because we have never been taught how to read it. So what this translation is going to do is help us to learn to read our own mother tongue. Later this year, there'll be an app so people can hear and read the patois. Right, there's more of that on our website, itv.com forward slash central. You can compare an English and Jamaican Patois version of the same Bible text.